was, I bless you today and I speak life over every one of you. You know, today I was just really pondering over pursuing and purpose. I want to encourage every one of you to do that, to pursue in God's purpose for you. Let me tell you, oppositions when you're about the Father's business will come at you from all different directions. <laughs> and it can be very, very painful. I will not uh, underestimate uh, sometimes that pain. But I will say this, that when we stay at the Master's feet and we continue to pray and we pursue in His purpose and His promise, He says that He will fulfill much greater things than we've ever seen. And he says in his word in Psalms 138, he says, The Lord will fulfill his purpose for you, for his love endures forever. Precious ones, I know it's tough. And I know that there's something that some of you are going through right now, where I can relate to some of that challenge. Um, but I know that when you pursue in God's purpose, he will fulfill the desires of your heart. He will bless you in ways that you can't even understand. So I want to encourage you, no matter the pain, no matter what you're going through, no matter the obstacles, God is able to turn it around for His good. And He's able to restore, to heal, uh, to reconcile, uh, to bless. He's able to do anything He desires to do. So if I can encourage you, don't you give up. You pursue in purpose. I know what it's like to go through waves and have moments of sadness over situations or challenges. Um, we're getting ready to reach about 800 people in our First Nations communities, maybe more. And uh, we have a lot of work ahead of us and we need help, we need support, we need finances. But I'm pursuing a purpose because God has called myself and our ministry to help these precious ones. And. Uh, I think about these little children, you know, they really don't have the support of real family that are even stable to take care of them. Uh, I myself was in the foster care system, six foster homes growing up, in and out of foster homes, uh, left, right, and center, <laughs> and police at my door quite frequently taking me out of my house to protect me. And I just want to say that God has taught me about pursuing a purpose. All the naysayers, the people who say it's not possible, the people who say you'll you'll end up being a troubled child the rest of your life. I got news for them all. <laughs> They're wrong. <laughs> God has a plan. And the enemy will try to keep you in that pit. He'll try to keep you in a place of despair or to even use the closest people that you love. People to, that are really close to you will try to keep you there. But I want to encourage you, you press in and know that you are an athlete in everyday life and you will succeed in God's purpose and His plan, all for His glory. So I just wanna encourage you, you keep pressing in and you pursue in purpose because God will fulfill His purpose for you, for His love endures forever. God bless you guys, I love you and we'll talk again soon. Bye for now.